claiming a disability for more child support or to gain an advantage with child custody is a tactic that is growing in popularity as the differences between men and women become narrower in divorce. Some parents actually suffer from disabilities that limit or prevent employment. These parents aren't faking it and are truly good parents dealing with difficulties. But there are those who just want a free ride or a way to one-up the other parent by claiming to be disabled. Falsely claiming a disability means that you have to claim you're incapable of supporting your children financially. The burden of supporting the children financially then falls to only one of two parents. You might be able to get by, but both parents will be so poor that neither parent nor the kids will be provided for financially to the full extent of both parents' abilities. When you claim a disability so that you don't have to work and then you force your spouse to pay all the child support, the paying parent has to work so much to provide income, meaning he or she has less time to meet other parental responsibilities and family needs. Or if and when they are available, they'll be so exhausted that they won't be much help. This is a despicable thing to do to the other parent and to the kids. Master manipulators will put on a show in court to gain sympathy. This tactic works generally better for women than it does for men. It is not our goal to be politically correct. We prefer fact, even unpopular fact, to political correctness. These are some things to think about if you're dealing with someone claiming or exploiting a disability to tip the odds to their favor. To challenge a false claim of disability, you'll need to get the assistance of experts in the field of mental health and experts who can test and prove your spouse is not as weak or disabled physically as he or she may be telling the court. Such experts and tests really do exist, and they really do work. While these experts do charge for their services, they more than pay for themselves if they can expose your spouse as lying about a disability he or she doesn't really have.